Hey, how's it going everybody? So, uh, last video that I made was actually, I actually showed you how to recover data from a non-bootable um, Windows 10 laptop. So, on this video, I'm going to actually show you an alternate way that you can actually get that data back. Now, of course, we're still going to be using the HP laptop that I used last time. But the things that you will need are going to be uh, basically something like this. So, this is a... Uh, Sabrent uh, USB 3 to SATA IDE uh, connection. So this is actually pretty good because this will actually work on 2.5 uh, and 3.5 hard drives. So yeah, this one is pretty good for that. And uh, basically, or if not, you could go right ahead and get one like this. And this one is a little bit just portable. It just uses, um, you know, the 3.0. It doesn't have an external power. Uh, just warning with this one, uh, it will only work on 2.5 um, hard drives, so just FYI. Well, now that we know what we need, uh, let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so what we're going to be doing uh, is I'm going to go right ahead and basically take out all of these screws here. And uh, what I'm going to do is once that is done, I'm going to go ahead and grab the hard drive from this and then we'll go ahead and connect it to a Windows 10 PC. Okay, now that we have uh, the system open, I'm going to go ahead and take out the hard drive from here. So uh, it is held by three screws, one here, one over here, and then this one here. So let me go ahead and get this done. And there we go. There is the hard drive. So most likely I'm gonna have to take uh, these uh, sides out. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do that. So once we have the hard drive out right here, we're gonna go ahead and use this Sabrent adapter right here. So all it is is just try and show you. Plug and play. So all you got to do is now basically connect it to a 3.0 um, USB port on your workstation. All right, now that we're inside of uh, a working Windows machine, let's go right ahead and go into this computer and let's go right ahead and recover the data. So just like last time, uh, basically the file structure is still the same. So we're going to go to users. And of course you see black, which is the one that we're going to go into. And of course default, default user zero, public. So let's go ahead and go to black. So once we're in here, we can actually see that we do have desktop. So let's go ahead and go into desktop. You do see the exact same thing. We have work, we have office.txt. And if we go into documents, we have all of my documents in there. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead and do... Uh, desktop documents I'm just gonna do downloads music pictures and video we're gonna go ahead and right click copy and for this I'm just gonna go ahead and leave them in my desktop so let's go ahead and paste them so there we go so uh, that is basically how we go right ahead and recover the data from a Windows 10 laptop that won't boot into Windows so just to verify I'm just gonna go into desktop we see the two files there, and if I go into Documents, we have all of our stuff there. I really do hope you enjoyed this video, and like always, we'll catch you on the next one.